That means that both William and Harry must bow when greeting their father, while Kate and Meghan must curtsy. When speaking to King Charles, members of the royal family will first refer to him as Your Majesty, followed by Sir. Dot the very damaging way Meghan Markle will always get compared to Kate Middleton. When Meghan Markle married into the royal family a little over a year ago, she went from being able to do as she pleased to suddenly having to follow a long list of rules and protocols set forth by Queen Elizabeth. Before meeting Prince Harry, Meghan lived a quiet life in Toronto where her show, Suits, was filmed, and it is pretty safe to say that she was able to do as she pleased. Not one for letting anyone dictate to her how she should live life, Meghan was, and still is known for putting her own spin on things. Now that she is officially a royal, Meghan is watched more closely and often criticized by members of the public as well as the news media. When she and Harry announced to the world that they were expecting their first baby, there was much speculation as to how they would raise their child. Baby Archie may only be a few months old, but already Meghan has made headlines on more than one occasion for her parenting choices. So, what is the very damaging way that Meghan Markle will always get compared to Kate Middleton? Kate is known for always following the rules. Ever since she became the Duchess of Cambridge in 2011, Kate has always been adamant about following the rules of the Royal Handbook. She makes sure to always dress as expected, and according to Marie Claire, she actually had to go through training to learn how to be a Duchess. Hello! Reports that they do allow things such as screen time for their children and that they want them to have typical school experiences. Kate also helps them with activities such as arts and crafts, and she encourages them to be open about their feelings at all times. Meghan has a more modern approach to parenting. She may be a brand new mother, but that doesn't mean that Meghan does not already have a plan in place for how she wishes to raise her son. According to Express, Meghan may try some alternative ways of parenting, and this may cause some additional pressure to be put on her as a new mother who is in the public eye. What is the damaging way that Meghan Markle will always get compared to Kate Middleton? According to a motherhood expert, Meghan will always be compared to Kate when it comes to her parenting approach. While every new mom, even the royals, has the right to choose how they will raise their children, the sad reality is that Meghan and Kate will always be judged by people around the world. Kate is more traditional, and Meghan will always be held up against her, with everyone voicing their opinions regarding all that she does. Although the Duchess of Sussex is not traditional, it certainly does not mean that she will not be an excellent mother. Even though Kate has been a mother for much longer, it seems that Meghan is doing a great job so far, and her choices are working out just fine. Dot.